Okay, so let's give, give it a look here. Look how open Kelsey is. Just beat off the line. No problem. Freaking touchdown. That's a one-play touchdown. You want plays like that in your book. Excellent. I'm going to show you how to win big with the Kansas City Chiefs playbook. We're going to go formation by formation. We're going to learn a couple of plays across the board. We don't need to learn the entire playbook. We only need 15 to 20 excellent plays to make this book sing for us. Let's jump right into the sprint flat. I like the sprint flat because it has this little zig route here with the outside tight end. It's a heavy set formation and we can even roll out no problem. We're rolling out. Look at this. We got uh, we got Schuster. Wide open, nice and easy. We pick up a first down. Same formation, wing pair. We're going to X burst cross. Another crossing play. This book is stacked with excellent play action plays. Okay, we're looking for Kelsey here. Again, we can get outside the pocket, create a little better throwing lane, and then wide open Kelsey. There we go. Next formation, let's go deuce close. Okay, 0-1 trap. If you don't know about the 0-1 trap, you're gonna have to learn it. Okay, 0-1 trap is awesome. It's got tons of running room. You're gonna you're gonna hit the holes and you're gonna pick up four or five yards every single time. We're gonna stay in single back. Remember, every play we're picking, we're going into random defense. I'm gonna go PA slide mesh. This play is awesome because it has a couple of crossers, has a couple of uh, has it has a corner route here. It's it's gonna be tough to guard. Play action plays in this book are super good. Look how open he is. All kinds of space, opportunity for 25 yards. Excellent. Okay, PA Flood. I like this play a lot. Look what is happening with Schuster here. Look what's happening with Hardman. And then you have Edwards Alera out of the backfield as a little bit of a bailout route. So we're looking, looking, looking. We have wide open triangle down the sideline. That's a touchdown, okay? This, this book is stacked with a ton of fun stuff like this. Same formation, tight wide off. You see this PA jet leak play? Do not touch this play. This play is horrific. It has one of the slowest setups on earth. And the only way you're gonna get this play off is if your your defense is running is rushing too. I mean, look, look at this thing. Look how bad this is, okay? Delay, 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 delay. I have some time. Okay, I have some time. I can run this. Oh, no, there's Kelsey. Okay, he's open. I told y'all not to run it. And then what happens is the defense gives me all day long. Okay, let's run it again. Okay, see the defense? See, that's a sack, okay? That's a sack. So one touchdown, one sack. High risk, high reward, I guess. Let's run it one more time. Okay, look at sack. It's a sack. I'm, I'm basically going to get sacked. But then Kelsey opens up, okay? But still, on the run, can't hit the throw. But you see what I'm saying? Like, the defense, like, absolutely clamps down this play because they think it's a, a jet sweep. And then you're, you get the, the coverage there. But then there's Kelsey. So we're two for four. I guess run this play. Try it. Maybe it'll work for you. It's high risk, high reward. It's either a sack or a touchdown. There's no in between. So I'm going to skip the I form. I'm going to skip the strong. I'm going to skip the weak. I'm going to go right into the pistol. The pistol is awesome. It has great plays like wide receiver under. This is one of my favorite plays in this book. Look at Kelsey. He's going to scream down the middle. And if he's not there, you're going to have you have square over the middle. Nice and easy. You also have the running back out of the backfield. We're going to hit. We're going to hit Kelsey. I'll show you how easy it is to hit Kelsey on this route. There's Kelsey. There's a first down. Nice and easy. There's also one of my favorite running plays. Speed option. Speed option is good as long as you have a mobile quarterback. Because I'm just going to roll out. I'm rolling out and then I'm pitching this thing. And look at this. I got all this space on the outside. It's great around the goal line. It, it is quite tricky to guard, especially if you have a big running back. I run this with the Browns sometimes. It's super tough to guard because you have you have Nick Chubb on the outside with a chance to break a tackle. That's super tough. RPO, read flat wheel. I love this play. I've told you guys about this play for a long time. It is a pretty much a first down every time. Look at this. Kelsey's going to open up on the outside. It's a quick read, and I'm just going to go with it. I'm picking up 15 yards. Staying in the same formation on Deuce Close, I'm going to look at the corner goes. Okay, corner goes is a fun play because look at this weird route that Kelsey runs. It's really tough for short yard spots. He's going to bend back inside. I can lead him. I can put it on the money. That's six yards. That's a first down in a lot of tight spots. If you're worried about the user, look at look at the tight end on the, on the opposite side here too. It does the same thing. You're going to create a lot of havoc with this play, especially in short yard spots. Red zone scissors, there's two different scissors plays in this book. This is the first one. Look what the running back does. See what he does here? Super tough to guard. 
They're going to have to make a choice. The linebacker's making a choice. He didn't. He stayed underneath. I'm going to hit him over top. 15 yards. No problem. Add scissors to your book right away. Do it now. Don't wait. The next play I'm running here is a screenplay. Look at this. Same formation. Edwards Alaire. He's going to open up where I'm going to run it on, on the outside. I call this a bailout screen because look at the defense. They get confused. I'm running for seven yards. No problem. Okay, I'm going to show you one of my favorite plays in this book. It's called Wheel Switch. We're going to run it real quick. There's one adjustment I want you to make. Take Schuster, the triangle route, put him in a slant, okay? I'm going to roll out to the right almost every time with this play. It's going to put immense pressure on the defense. You see Schuster open up, boom. It basically turns into a flood play because what happens is there's so much pressure on this right-hand side that they're going to make a mistake. Someone's going to open up. Okay, look at Kelsey. He's wide open now. That's a touchdown. Over top of the defense, boom. But it's because there's so much pressure and there's so many handoffs and communications they have to do that you're not going to be able to guard all three of these, okay? When I say three, I mean Schuster, I mean Kelsey, and I mean I mean the underneath route with the running back. That's a touchdown. Tall guy, what about some RPOs? What about some, some other fire stuff? Here we go. RPO, Y, zone Y peak. This play is awesome. This one's a tough one. You're looking at the Kelsey read, okay? This, this read is the most important read. It's super simple. Look at the outside linebacker. If it's there, you have a you have a freaking you know 10 yards easy. If it's not, you're handed off, pick up six. Let's run it one more time here. Okay, it's there. Boom. Freaking touchdown, man. I'm telling you, these plays are game changers. You have to make the read properly, okay? Watch the outside linebacker. It's there. It's, I, I, I knew it was there so quickly. 10, 15 yards off an RPO. Now they're going to have to go in the box. And now they, they try to man that side up. Now what I'm doing, I'm just going to hand it off. And now the left side is open. Now I got opportunity. Remember, Madden is a chess game, and you are the chess master. You're going to take what the defense gives you. We're not going to force things. Look at this weird play. Jet, chip, wasp. This play is such a weird play because of the way that route sets up for Schuster. But I'm gonna show you how to make it a little bit better, okay? So I'm gonna put Kelsey in a go route, I'm gonna put Hardman in, in a block, and I'm gonna look for Schuster. And if that's not there, I'm gonna hit Hardman, okay? So Kelsey's gonna clear out the overtop defenders, I'm gonna be able to hit the crosser, and I'm picking up big yards. Kelsey in the slot is OP, get used to it. And it takes so long to make that final cut, so you have to time it out. So there's a timing, I hit the timing properly, I went up top, I got the touchdown. Really tough play, but a ton of fun. I'd only run that to Schuster intentionally if I was up big. I'd probably look for the Kelsey go route or the Hardman crossing if I was going to run this on a regular basis. Because look at that. So open. Kelsey demands so much freaking attention that you get that wide open crosser. Shovel option. This plays wild. It's it's. I wouldn't always recommend it. It's, it's for a more advanced user. It's, it's a pitch play that like has some big potential, but it also has the opportunity to like cost you with a big fumble. <laughs> Practice it first. You got to read the defense properly and then just kind of toss it off to the side with L1 and then you're good to go. It also doesn't guard the, the, the quarterback properly sometimes. You can sprint out with the quarterback. Like, look at this. This is a free touchdown. <laughs> so it's wild, man. Shovel option. Check it out. Don't check it out. It's a wild play. What is your favorite play from this book? Let me know in the comments below. Also, what playbook should I do next? I'm going to be doing all 32 teams. Whatever team is commented on the most will be the next book I do. If you enjoyed this video, I hope to see you at the next one. You can find me below at all the fun places, Instagram, Twitter, all that. I'll see you soon at the next video. Thanks so much for watching. Tall guy, over and out one because it's a little creative does something different it's it's crazy risky you can't always get a clean pitch off this is the first of my entire series of the breakdowns for every single playbook blah blah blah, blah. that wasn't good